In today's video, I am going to show you how to pick or choose your YouTube handle. It's a simplified version of making it easier for people to find you when you're doing your post on social media, redirecting them back to your YouTube channel. I'm gonna show you where to find it, how to do it, and also how it can benefit you. And we're starting now. All right, so recently most of us have gotten an email that says you can now choose your YouTube handle. Now, I do want to mention it is not rolled out to everyone yet. However, stay tuned and look for your email check back as it may pop up in your inbox real soon. So we're gonna go ahead and click on choose a handle. I've already chosen my YouTube handle at tips for social media. However, it used to say Quincy Moreland down here. Um, so let's go ahead and change it. We'll click on it, and as you see, that's what I recently chose. But if I wanted to uh, change it, it would be just like TikTok and Instagram where it's gonna show you what's available and what's not available. So originally, I wanted to put social media tips. And of course, you see the red exclamation mark and it tells you uh, it's not available, but it tells you what is available. Now, real quick, the good thing while I'm editing this video is it's good that it's already taken if you're searching for it because that tells you as a YouTuber that no one can steal your um, identity as far as trying to be you in the comments. You know, maybe you're you have a, a real good following and people are trying to you know uh, get money from other people pretending to be you. You know, so yeah. YouTubers have the blue check mark when they get over 100,000 subscribers, the verified. But now, even if you don't have that uh, blue uh, check mark for verification and you are uh, a small YouTuber, you can still be authentic because you have your own YouTube handle. Now, it also tells you that what your current, if you picked a URL already, that will still work. So previously, my URL was uh, Quincy Moreland. I'm not gonna change this, but if I was to paste in what I wanted, it's gonna tell me that's still available, but that's because it knows that I chose it already. So you hit um, confirm your selection. So now you have two ways to redirect people to your channel, youtube.com forward slash at tips for social media, or if you are posting on different platforms such as um, Facebook, you can now include that in a post. You know, hey, follow me on my uh, YouTube uh, platform at tips for social media. So unlike channel names, just as I was mentioning, like Instagram, where you have the name at the top of your profile, um, there's a username that everyone has as well. Same thing, YouTube is just now getting around to it so that users can be found easier and it be more user friendly when you're searching for someone or you wanna tag someone. You don't have to worry about your customized URL disappearing because they tell you right here that it will still continue to work. And I've never changed that. Even if I go into my um, uh, YouTube studio back room and I go to uh, customization, basic info right here it shows that this is my custom url and it is still there now me personally i chose to by default um, have in my description at tips for social media um, it shows this is where your handle is right here so it's a new section as well under basic info so you can find a uh, handle and then you can find custom url now i could change that to the custom url but why do that when basically now I can have three ways. I can give them my custom URL that I chose a, f a few years back, um, or I can give them uh, this right here, which is the URL with the handle, or I can just give them the handle. People who are making shorts can now tag you in their shorts. So as they make a description, if they want to tag you and give you a shout out or information, um, or for you to be uh, contacted as well, when they create that description and tag you, just as it shows over here, your name or your channel will pop up, making it easier for people to find you on YouTube. Also on the YouTube page itself, if I was to type up at, you see right away, here are people's handles. If you haven't already gotten this email, that's what you wanna be looking for. If you're watching this video and you're saying, you know what, I don't have that option. Now, if you haven't seen the email and you think you may already have the feature, you wanna go to your YouTube studio and click on customization. Under customization, go to basic info and in basic info, 
that's where it's going to say choose your unique handle by adding letters and numbers you uh, can change your handle back to um, whatever it previously was in 14 days it says hey if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to the channel give this video a like and share it with someone else who can use this information all right and then until next time i will see you on the next video